You know, as a new manager, it's really easy to feel overwhelmed and even distracted with day-to-day -day tasks. And I vividly remember sitting in my continuous improvement training and the leader standard work was introduced and that was my aha moment. You know, leader standard work to me is probably one of the most important documents or standards that I have during the day. I have enough roles and enough projects and programs I work on. I used to feel like I couldn't get everything done I needed to in a day and I felt like I wasn't getting everything done well. And when I started using leader standard work and developing it and perfecting it, come to find out that I could accomplish a lot more. Having this simple piece of paper with me keeps me on task and keeps me oriented to what I need to do to complete out my day and complete out my week. For me, uh, standard work is simply a checklist that helps me remember some of the critical details that I have um, that I don't want to forget. It was a tool that I needed to be able to track and organize and be able to follow up. The first thing on there every day is to review my calendar and kind of envision the day. My leader standard work includes a lot of my goals and um, a lot of the metrics that I keep track of in all my departments. Uh, it's right there. I can look at it. Anyone can ask me where I'm at and I'll know immediately. It's also been very helpful as I've taken time off that I've been able to print out my standard work and provide it to my team that they have a guide to use to make sure that the tasks are being completed. At Intermountain Healthcare, we have valued ourselves on talking about standardizing clinical care. And often we think that that only applies to the clinicians. But in reality, using standards help us in leadership roles to do our job better. Within our Intermountain Continuous Improvement, we have three components of standard work. One is leader standard work. Another is key process standard work. So that is, what are the key processes that I'm responsible for as a leader that I need to make sure that I'm doing in order to be successful? And the third is standard calendar, which is what's the cadence of the things that I do and when I do them so that we can organize the work that we're um, engaged in. So I've had standard work for a long time, I've had key process standard work for a long time, but I had it in files and I had it on my desk or on my iPad. And what I found is that I wasn't as good and consistent about it. When I can come in and see every day, oh yeah, I've got to do this, number one. And number two, I wanted to message to my leadership team that this is a really important concept. You know, we're asking clinical leaders to, to live by clinical standards. If we're not doing that, if we're not willing to do that as administrative leaders, this kind of sounds a little hypocritical to me. And ideally, I'd like to see this throughout the entire region. It should be a working and breathing document. Remember, you don't work for the leader standard work, it works for you. So this has been a great tool for me uh, to be much more effective in what I do. I think it's consistent with Intermountain's uh, vision of delivering extraordinary care through the principles that Brent James has taught us around continuous improvement and standardization, and I hope that you can find it to be helpful as well.